Bop, 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 bop. Reggie has no butthole. Reggie has no butthole. Reggie has no butthole, making it so hard to pop. Reggie has no butthole. Reggie has no butthole. Reggie has no butthole, making it so hard to poop. Content you get here. Yeah, hey, welcome man. back to our stupid directory. It's Corbin. I'm not Reggie. And you follow us on Instagram. 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 For anyone out there who does not have a butthole, my apologies for the impromptu songwriting. <laughs> Subscribe if you haven't hit the like button for that juicy intro there. Then I know you all skipped it. Play you, it over. You missed gold. You missed comedic and musical gold. Yes. Uh, a golden shower, if you will. Uh... I've never understood the appeal. The appeal? Yep. I that that and 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 there's people who like to well, I'm not even gonna say what it is, it's too gross. There's people who <laughs> like gross things and I don't understand it. What? Today we got a video. It's from the Village Cooking Channel. I was hoping you were gonna say it's from the Village People. No. Village Cooking I Channel. I would love YMCA. I uh, no, this is I they're the, okay. It's gonna be endearing. The video quality is going to be superb. I love the video quality. And boy, are we going to get hungry. Oh, yeah. But this is, say that word. Arabian mutton brownie. Ooh. With two full goat. Two full goat. So I apologize to our veg viewers. <laughs> Always for the, because if, if you are, I'm assuming you're just not going to watch this one. Probably. <laughs> yeah. Because there's going to be a lot of meat murder. Yeah. Uh, here. You know I was talking to actually a friend of mine. We don't. Goat is just something that is not. No, it isn't. Here very it's interesting. Not it's, it's almost like very a, rare. Something that you'd get at a nice restaurant. Lamb is incredibly common in places comparatively. But yeah, not as con like chicken. That's what no. we eat. chicken and beef. chicken, beef, and sometimes turkey in most places. Yeah, but the, as well. the, the primary protein you're going to find chicken as an alternative to a beef option everywhere. Everywhere, but. Yeah, mutton and goat, which is yeah. synonymous. That's not a very More common high-end restaurant. Yeah, it's like a specialty meat. You can find it, but you have to really, really look for it. But I would love for these people to cook for me. No kidding. I would love to be there while they're doing it. Too. Uh, yeah, me too. I love their energy. And I love it's just the video sound, that they don't put any narration or music. Yep, that's a dead goat. <laughs> already already cleaned. <laughs> <laughs> I could watch this as like falling asleep video, man. Yeah. It would be so relaxing just to flip. I might, I might do that later. Yeah, I love that they show the whole setup process too. I love it. Just love it. What a great sound. I know. You know what that, you know what that feels like? It's light and it makes your hands dirty. Looks like. Oh, ginger garlic paste. Ben Gaia. It's a good sound. Oh, they didn't even peel those. 
Does that go in the middle? Yeah. Uh, okay. I was like, what are they doing? So it heats it all around rather than just underneath. Oh, then those will make it flame uh-huh. on the side. Interesting. And I, I guess you just keep track of time, right? That was awesome. Oh, that's got to smell glorious. <clears throat> Making his own um, garam masala. Mm. Oh, my goodness. Oh. oh, look at that. So was that... I think that's different. Organs? What? Like from inside he, no, he them? said it was mutton meat. Yeah. I mean, it could be liver, pancreas, stomach... Yep. Briyani masala, huh? Oh! I can smell it. Smell vision. Wow. <sighs> Indians use curd in a lot. Oh, my goodness. You love a good fried onion? Love fried onions so much. It's one of my favorite things at Thanksgiving on the green bean salad when they cover it in the fried onions. Oh. That's a big pot. practically smell that thing. You making the rice now? I guess. Yeah, it has to be the rice. Yeah. Just making food out outside. Gotta love it. Basmati rice. That's a big s- spoon. Or what are those things called with the holes? Oh yeah, your mom. Sorry. Oh, Whew. nice heaping scoop of rice. Oh, that sound. <laughs> The level of love my wife has for rice is unlike anything I've ever seen for a food. I gotta layer it. What is this? Saffron milk. They just soak the saffron in the milk. I'm pretty sure. Cashews. You know what cashews will always remind me of? Hmm. Peacocks, because that's what. Oh yeah. At, at the. These raisins. Coriander leaves. Another thing of rice.
Did they heap all of that on top of the goat meat? It's just going to fall off the bone, isn't it? The ginger, the onion, the tomato. Oh, they're just going to go at it. It's just going to be served on top of the biryani. Oh. And then when they just sit down, everybody's just going to go grab handfuls. Yeah, I wouldn't be able to do that. No? <laughs> you know I don't like stuff that looks like it's Well, I know you don't self. even eat it off the bone, do you? Mm. Yeah. Like your wings are boneless. Unfortunately. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so oh, no, they, they did take it, it apart. Okay. Maybe it was just for the picture? Must have been. Got to get the thumbnail, you know? Goodness gracious. So they got all that other pre Oh, Ooh. that's a yogurty thing. <gasps> They've got the, the other cooked stuff that's in the middle of it, off the bone, plus the fresh... <laughs> We always do this. I love it. Me too. Watermelon juice. I love their channel. They have a great channel. Everything about their channel is amazing. Obviously, their yep. content of, of of cooking it, and and but the video quality makes it so engaging and beautiful, and it's almost ASMR kind of. It feels like you can smell it a lot of times. Yep. And then the payoff at the end. I mean, I would hope that even if you're vegan or vegetarian, you would watch and support. They're, they're, look at all of these beautiful people they're feeding, many of whom can't cook for themselves. Mm -hmm. um, I, I, I just love their channel. Yeah, their channels. It's always, I don't think it's possible to be disappointed with a video of theirs. Never. Just one, you're, you're seeing people with a, a major skill yeah. of being able to do what they do. And it look, turns out so good. I would have loved to be able to like, just go there and eat, like, eat whatever they make. Absolutely. And be there just be there, help it. them do it. Yeah. Just carry the heavy load or just put some wood on the fire for them. And, oh, I think it would be And amazing. that's the other, they have such joy mm -hmm. in making what they make and eating it. Yeah. It's contagious joy that they have. Yeah. Uh, they're just, this is the very first video we ever saw. Like, love the, love this channel. Oh, now I want mutton biryani. Oh, my goodness. I, I, I just, I don't think I've had mutton biryani. I think I've had chicken biryani. I haven't. You know, of all the mutton things I've tasted, which aren't a grand number, but... In, well, in, unless we had it in India. We, well, I had it in Kolkata. That's where I first had mutton. a mutton, a beautiful mutton hand roll that... Two of them. One from a restaurant, one that was a street food kind of a thing that was just off the charts, extraordinarily delicious. Um, I wish... That's something Indrani misses, is just being able to get just like a mutton hand roll. Just a real inexpensive... Just go grab... A mutton roll and eat it. So good. Yeah. Shocker, I'm hungry. Yep. Uh, anyways, let us know what other videos there's, other food videos we can react to down below. Down below means to comments, by the way, in case some of you don't understand what I'm saying. Josh!